So what is Somoji effect, the hidden cause of morning high sugar? Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Karan and from Dr. PK Life. If your blood sugar is low at night, uh, but high in the morning, uh, this could be Somoji effect, one of the most misunderstood patterns in diabetes. It is a rebound rise in blood sugar that happens after your glucose drops too low during the night. The body releases a stress hormone because of drop in sugar, almost like a hypoglycemia. Uh, and the reaction of body is adrenaline, cortisol, and glucagon to counteract hypoglycemia, to bring sugar back up, but sometimes it overcorrects, leading to high morning reading. And um, uh, this happens when you're taking too much evening insulin. Uh, so when you're taking too much evening insulin, Early in the morning, your blood sugar gonna drop down in a hypoglycemic range, uh, causing the reaction in the body and release of those hormones. Or you skip a bedtime snack. Sometimes happens also because of long gaps between dinner and sleep because uh, you're out partying or some uh, social engagements or activity or you know traveling and things like that. Um, and sometimes because of unrecognized nighttime hypoglycemia. These two, uh, these low sugars trigger the liver to release glucose, causing a rebound hyperglycemia by morning. Uh, how do you identify it? Check your blood sugar at 3, 3 a.m. for two nights. If it is low, less than 70 and high in the morning, it's Somoji effect. If it is normal or high at 3 a.m. and higher in the morning, it's dawn phenomenon. And uh, using a continuous glucose monitoring makes this pattern very easy to spot. How to prevent it? Have a small protein snack before bed. Avoid late night alcohol. Adjust evening insulin with consultation with your doctor. Use long um, acting insulin instead of intermediate ones if advised by your doctor and sleep consistently. The, the Somoji effect is your body's overreaction to a nighttime low glucose or mild hypoglycemia. It's not a sign of failure, it's a signal to fine tune your insulin and bedtime habits. That's it. Thank you for watching.